just want to apologize to any of the Sangat that don't understand English. Um, I appreciate that you might not understand what I'm saying. Um, any Punjabi that I do know, if it can be called that, is very tutti fruity. So um, I'm going to uh, share with you what I've learned from this Shabad in English and um, <coughs> Papa Ji will read the Shabad. Satnam Sri Vahidru Sahib Jiyo Sarun Mahala Panjwaan Har Jan Ram 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 Tiyaye So from my understanding of this, um, Guru Arjun Dev Ji is saying that the servant of God is the person who meditates on Vaidru's name, Ram Ram Ram, Vaidru Vaidru Vaidru. This line can be seen as a definition of what a Guru servant is supposed to do. So many people say that if you want to be a servant, you can serve Langar, um, do other types of Hadi Seva, and these are all great Sevas, they will be rewarded, They're, they'll be banked, if you will. Um, but the biggest seva is Nam Japanam. So Guru Sahib says, Nam Hamare Puja Dev, Nam Hamare Gurgi Sev. So Guruji is saying that to Jap Nam, that is the biggest seva. You might think, well, why is this the biggest seva? So Padshah says, Art Baher Har Har Jaskaye. Art Baher means to Jap Nam 24, sorry, Art Baher means 24 hours a day. So if you are a servant of Guru, who actually obeys Guru's hukam, that and jumps Nam 24 hours a day and is putting their 100% effort into that, that is the true seva. But why is this the true seva? So to do continuous Nam Japo, that's how we emerge with, with we, um, we merge with the Galpa Gwaidun. So we've sat in Sangat today and we've jumped Nam, but why haven't we merged with Guru Saib yet? So in Jabri Saib, Guru Nanak Dev Ji says, give, give Sajjara Hoye, give Gure Gupe Balm, so this means that to merge with the true one, we must first get rid of that veil of falsehood um, that stands between us and the Galpa Gwaibu inside. So that veil that stands between us is the ego, it's that homer, that um, I am such and such. It's the idea that I am this and Guru Sahib is somewhere else. So we know in principle that Guru Sahib is everywhere, but, um, but to actually have put that in practice and um, to actually understand that, um, that he is inside all of us. So by doing this biggest seva of jumping Nam, that means that to jump Nam, that gets rid of the ego. So that person who actually does the tu tu, why guru, why guru, ram ram, gets to the point where they no longer remember that self. There's no longer that I, that ego is gone. Why guru, guru mandir hai, jab homme koi. That homme, that I, that ego that comes from the japana of the guru mandir, why guru, that ego is destroyed. So once the ego is destroyed, give gure to debal, that veil is gone and all you see is why guru. And then what happens is, so when there's no difference between me, like us and the Galba Gwaigu, that then we can do that true seva because we then see Galba everywhere. So once you see a Galba everywhere, that's when you can do that true seva. You can save the world, you can save the people, all the creatures, um, everything that Galba created is within his creations. So that's why Harjan Ram 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 Thiai, that's why the Guru meditates on Guruji's name because that biggest silver that Guruji has given to us is how we get rid of that ego and that's how we meet a Galpa Gwaigu and once we've merged with a Galpa Gwaigu that's how we can really help people and do the true silver. <laughs> So we've mentioned the importance of Nam Japana, but this line of Gurbani uh, highlights how important Saad Sangat is. Ik Baluk is in inst one instant, so you can see that as a shorter period than it takes you to blink. So Gord Begunt, Begunt is um, heavens, Gord is millions. So to sit in Saad Sangat, for less than the time it takes you to blink, you're blessed with millions of heavens. But why are we being blessed with these millions of heavens by sitting in Sad Sangat? 
Gusev says, Sat Sangat Gesi Janya Jitta Eko Nam Vakanya. So that means where the Sad Sangat that you sit in has to be inspiring you to Japnam. So in that, it, this is the code of conduct that Amritadi people follow. Um, it says, Ik Sik Doi Sad Sang, Bunchi Parmesur, Vits Ikis, Avgat Upe. This means that when there's one Sikh, um, that is a good Sikh. When there's two Sikhs, that's Sad Sangat. Where there are five six that can be seen as a god or Kaibuji himself. But this Akis is where there are more than 26. You cannot put that into enough phrase to describe how amazing that is to be sitting in Sangat of more than 20 people. This is something that Bai Jivan Singh used to say um, when people think that, oh, I'm running late for the van or it's too late to go now. It's something that Bai Jivan Singh would say, even if you can sit there for being sad saying it's for less than the time it takes you to blink it's equivalent to millions of um of heavens raha dulab de jap hot punita jam ki tras nevare so dulab means incredibly precious there is your body so dulab de is talking about this incredibly precious body that we've been given so we know that there's around 8.4 billion life million life forms but to be in this human body, in Sangat. Bonita means to become pure. So by doing the jap of Nam, this precious body becomes pure. Jam ki tras nivare. So jam is referring to jam boots. Tras is fear. So jam ki tras is the fear of death that is destroyed by meditating on a Gadra Gwaigu. Mahapatat ke patik utare hai, har nama urdhare. Patat means sinner. Mahapatit is the greatest type of sinner, the incredibly strong sins, unimaginable. But, but Ul means heart, Dare means to install. So by installing Nam in your heart and keeping Guruji close, even the biggest of sins are washed away. Jojo sunay Ram jas nirmala, taka janam maran dukhna sa. So whoever listens or hears Ram jas, the praise of a God for Kwaigu, so then that person's pains of birth and death, death, death is removed. Guru Nanak Dev Ji says that by great good fortune, that's what Vodbhagi means, Mantan Hoi Bagasa, the person who meets with the Gaapa Gwaigu, his body and soul blossoms. Sorry for any mistakes that I made. Why did you cut that?